All right. So, hopefully this is recording. All right. Today, we're looking at naming number places. Okay? So, we have the English version. Ooh. And the Spanish version. Except for, is million, million? Million. Okay. So, so we'll start with the English version. Okay. Where your decimal place is. Okay. Your first number over is the ones place. Now, if it asks in a story problem how many units are to the nearest unit, unit and ones are the same thing. Okay. So, ones place is here. Tens place. Hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands, millions. And if we keep going, the next one would be ten millions, hundred millions, billions, ten billions, hundred billions, and trillions, and so on. When you get to the other side of the decimal point, okay, it's not the once. We don't have a once place, okay? You just go to the next one over from there, okay? So if this is the tens here, this is the tenths with a th on it, tenths. If this is the hundreds, then the next one is the hundreds. So it goes ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. So it goes tenths with a th, hundreds with a th, thousands with a th, ten thousands, hundred thousands, and so on. The next one would be uh, the millions with a TH on it. Okay? So you need to know the decimal places. Okay? You need to know the decimal places. In Spanish, unos. What is this? That's the. So the tens place is the decenas. Decenas, cientos, miles, miles, des mil, or des miles, or des mil, des mil, cien mil, and million. So when you get to the other side of the decimal point, see how this and this go together, just like English. Okay? So decimas. See, oh, I say that again. No, this one. Centesimas, 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 millesimas, dies millesimas, and cien millesimas. Okay? So are we good with that? Okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write down a number, and you're going to tell me what place it is. All right, so get out your marker boards and your markers, okay? Marker boards and markers, and you're going to flip the answer to me, okay? So everybody has to answer, so so I know which what the answer is. Two thirty seven point four seven eight. All right, so tell me what I just underlined. Spell the word out. Spell the word out. What place did I just underline? Spell the word out. And flip your cards to me so I can see them. It is the tens without a TH. Don't put a TH on. Because the tenths place is here, the tens without a th is here. So this is tens, this is tenths. Okay? So that was the tens place. Okay? So the next one is this one. Spell that out. Spell that out. What is my eight up there in what place? Okay? So it's one, two, three back from the decimal. 
See what? See if you can think of that word. What place is that? All right, flip that around, please. It is the thousands. This is the tens. This is the hundreds. This is the thousands with a TH. So this is the thousands. Okay, with a TH, the thousands. Okay, let's do another one. Um, let's go this one, that one. What place is that? What place is that? On your mark, get set, show me. There we go. The ones place, ones place. So Spanish unos, unos, yeah, unos place. Okay. Then, hmm, let's go this one. The four. What is the four? What do we call that? Where the four is at? Okay. One, two, three, show me. The tense with a TH. The tense with a TH. Okay, so let's go back to the cheat sheet again. Okay, so when we're over here to this side, we start with the tens, hundreds, thousands, then thousands, hundred thousands. When we're on this side, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands, millions, okay? So this matches this with a TH. This matches this with a TH. It's just we've got this ones place right here. So this is not the once, it's the tense. You take this one and move it over and put a TH on, okay? All right, all right, so we're gonna do this a little bit more, all right. So now, okay, tell me what the seven is. What place is the seven in? Okay. Now, there's no decimal point on this. Okay, these are commas. So ones, tens, hundreds, and then think of what would the seven be? Write it down, please. What would the seven be? Okay, so ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, ten thousands. Some of you did good, some of you just were off by a little bit. Ten thousands. Okay, let's get that one. The six. The six. What place is the six in? And this should be the same in English and Spanish. What is the six in? Okay. And what is it, everyone? Millions. Millions. Okay. So, we will have a bunch of problems like this, and you'll have to figure out what place it's in. Then, yeah, that's what this will be, okay? Now, let's make this a little harder.
All right. So, once again, what's this one called, everyone? The tenths. The tenths, because the decimal point is right there. That's the tenths with a TH. So, after the tenths becomes the hundredths. So, hundredths, thousandths, ten thousandths. So, what is the five? Write it down on your board. What would the five be? Okay. So, we went tenths, hundredths with a TH, thousandths, ten thousandths. What would this be? Not quite. You want too much because that's what the eight would be. So you got to go in between there. So tenths, hundredths, thousandths, ten thousandths. And what do you got, Mr. Eggsdale? Hundred thousandths. That is correct. This is the hundred thousandths place. Okay, so what we're going to work on for the, for the rest of the time here is I've got a worksheet, and Mrs. Odegaard and myself and Christina will work our way around the room helping you, and we're going to write out the places. Now, the charts I'll leave on the board, and you can, so then you've got your words there. Okay, so I'll leave them up there for a little bit, but they're not going to be up there the whole time. Okay, so you got to learn these. Now, English or Espanol? Espanol, okay. Yeah, they are. All right, well, Espanol, Espanol. They're the same worksheet. One's in the directions in English. So they can actually, I have the answers in Spanish. So they can write in Spanish if they want. Okay. Okay. So I'll probably have the cheat sheet up for about five minutes or so. So you want one? Yes. Gonna ask, I get an extra one. Yep, I do. So write down the word of the decimal place for each of these. Write down the word for the decimal place for each of these. Make sure you put your names on them. Nombre, por favor. Nombre at the top.
No, that's not, that's a comma. So that would be the first number, just like this is the first number. So it's the ones. Tiny bit bigger. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, take them away. Now you got to do this on your own. Now you got to do this on your own. So if you have questions, we will be around to help you. So if you don't know for sure, we'll be around to help. So you just don't have the words in front of you right now. 